Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since my last video. Today I'm excited to dive into the ACC Model Viewer's Model Browser and explore its powerful filter options. This video will show you how to better investigate your model and focus on the specific elements that matter most to you. To start, let's open a Revit file. Click on the Sheets and Views button, then select one of the published views. At its core, the Model Browser's filter feature allows you to isolate specific elements, just like selecting an element, right-clicking, and choosing Isolate from the context menu. Press Escape to remove any applied filters. You also have access to the default dropdowns and search bars for levels, categories, and disciplines to quickly refine which elements you're viewing. If you want to clear all filters and viewing adjustments, click the X icon and choose Reset. To expand your filter options, click Edit Filters and select Additional Properties to add them to the drop-down menu. Once added, these properties become new filter tools, making it easier to refine your focus on very specific elements if needed. Another useful feature is the filter tree. You can quickly isolate elements by selecting them in the tree, which automatically hides everything else. Next, let's explore how filters work with other file type. Open an IFC file, and once it's loaded, click on the model browser. You'll notice that the IFC elements can also be isolated using the drop-downs, search bars, or the filter tree. Again, use the X icon to reset the view if needed. Moving on to a DWG file, Remember that if you find the color on white background for DWGs difficult to view, you can adjust this. Go to settings in the toolbar, select appearance, and toggle on 2D sheet color mode. In DWG files, the model browser filters out blocks and other entities, but doesn't provide detailed filtering options. Instead, it's best to use the layer tool for DWGs, which lets you filter by the file's layers. You can also use the search bar here to quickly find specific layers. For Navisworks files, the model browser offers similar filtering to other 3D files. Use the available filters and model tree to select and isolate the elements you're interested in. In addition, the Viewpoints tool will display available viewpoints from the Navisworks file. You can leverage this functionality by setting up viewpoints of areas of interest in Navisworks to accelerate the review process. I hope this video was helpful. Let's keep building better in the cloud. Stay tuned for more tips and tools. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.